There are many ways to keep warm when riding in winter, but without doubt the most affected is heated clothing. Warmth at the touch of a button is a great option to have, and one of the leading brands in heated garments is UK company Kais. The somewhat unimaginatively named Premium J501RP is the newest garment in the Kais range. It's similar to the existing J501, but there are a few changes other than the new color combination. Let's start by looking at the tech. The J501RP still contains the microcarbon fiber elements in the back, chest, arms and collar, but the outer material is now lighter and thinner, making it a slimmer profile under your motorcycle jacket. The black finish with red piping is classy and is a little less in your face than the old jacket's use of red panels. There's a stretch panel in the side to help with a snug fit, and that's important. The closer fitting the jacket is, the better the heat radiation. There are plenty of connection options built in. The pocket in the lower inside hides the connector lead for the main 12 volt supply. A cable that connects to the battery terminals is supplied in the box with spare fuses. It's important to remember to install the correct fuse in the inline holder. Make sure it's a high enough rating to cover all of your items. For example, the jacket draws seven amps, and if you're wearing that with gloves that draw one amp, you'll need at least an eight amp fuse in the holder. The front outer pocket hosts the connector for the heat controller. You can run it without leaving the loop in place, but the jacket will default to its hottest setting permanently but a controller does come with the jacket. There's a connector inside to power heated trousers or insoles, and of course, cables in the sleeves to power the gloves. Take note, Kais switched the plugs on 2020 and on newer gloves to a male connector. So if you want to use a combination of old and new items, you will require adapters. However, Kais will send these to you free of charge. The benefit of using the gloves and the jacket combined is that you can run the different items at different temperatures. So if you want to run the gloves at the highest setting and the jacket at its lowest, you can do, or vice versa, or you can turn the jacket off completely and leave the gloves on, and again, vice versa. You can use a battery pack with this jacket, but as the power draw is so high, the battery will not last very long at all. So it's recommended to use the 12 volt supply from the bike. You can purchase a cable with a 12 volt DIN and cigarette lighter style connector if you prefer not to hardwire the device in. The jacket is comfortable to wear with a fleece lined collar and jersey knit cuffs, and I'd recommend going down a size to get the correct snug fit. That's all for the tech, but what's it like in use? Well, I have to say the jacket warms up almost instantly and it has a really nice even heat. You don't notice individual panels, it just gives a all round comfy glow. It gets pretty warm too, enough to keep you going in sub-zero temperatures for hours. The heating element in the collar is particularly nice. The jacket does obviously take up room under your motorcycle outer. I would equate it to something similar to a micro fleece mid layer or indeed a jacket's zip in thermal liner. In fact, wearing it under my RST X-ray jacket felt pretty much the same as having that thermal liner fitted. So if you get the right sizing, it doesn't make you feel all bundled up. There's enough length in the cables to get everything connected easily and other than being connected to the bike, you wouldn't know you're all cabled up. At £199, I think the jacket is well priced, and if you ride all year round, it's definitely a good investment. So confident in the quality are Kais that they offer a lifetime guarantee on all of their garments. I've added links in the description to where you can find out more, and if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. If you're new to the channel and like to see more of these reviews, then please hit that subscribe button. And until next time, I just want to say thanks for watching. Take care, ride safe, and I'll see you soon. Bye.